guys, it's Ratchet Throw, and today we're gonna continue playing Criminal Case, Case 10, Smoke and Mirror. So let's have a digital investigation. It's very good you did as us all proud. You put an end to the video's worst series of crimes. But it's not over yet, we still don't know what happened to the bodies of these three girls who went missing. It's time to reopen these cases. And I also need you to go back to the brothel. The area is secure, but I'd rather make sure it's secure until they manage to put the fire out. But yeah, maybe we could talk to Harvey about the cold cases. They have hunted him for so long. I agree, it might be good for him to help us to the bottom of this. That seems like a sensible idea. Katrina, I can meet you up, up to, at the mansion when you're done with Harvey. Okay. Just two persons are here. And of course, finish this chapter to earn one sticker pack. Alright, let's first talk to Harvey. He said, Katrina, you're really telling me you're reopening the cases of the missing baby girls. Please have you find a new lead or whatever. I had given up on them, but I should have done what you did. I should have been able to stop that crazy voodoo chick. Stop beating yourself up over this, Harvey. Inspector has given you one last chance to close this case, is it? It's useless. Even that poor Vanessa knew more about the case than I did. I lost my touch long ago, Frank, no matter what Inspector says. Actually, Inspector is right. You raised a good boy. Vanessa is the one person who knew the most about this unsolved case. She may have gathered more info. Good call, Katrina. Let's go back to that hut she did. He didn't. Uh, thanks for the input, Harvey. We'll keep you updated. Okay. But. Where should we go first? No, well, let's just go first to Brotel. Here we go. Where's comp? Okay, there you are. Pile of embers. Okay, I think that's what we need. Are you? Hey. Ah, you were hiding me with this. Okay, so, uh, rookie. Where's pearl necklace? Okay, there you are. A uh, shaker. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, here we go. Hello. Oh, where's the accordion? Oh, there you are. Uh, more set, sheet music, and umbrella. Okay, you got to everything. Please be careful, Katrina. The place seems secure enough, but don't burn your hands with these inverts when you have a look through them. Don't worry, I won't. But first, let's go to the hot pathway. Okay, what do we have here? I have a new uh, ID card. Where's that? Okay, here we go. Uh, pass, uh, trumpet. Come on, come on. No, there is to me. Okay, there you are. Uh, chili pepper. Got it. Piano. Tombstone. Uh, business call. Mouse. Uh, raven. Where's the amplifier? Okay, there you are. So I found an ID card. Oh, well observed, Katir. She's one of our three missing girls. Dolores lovely. She's the first girl who disappeared. I wonder where where Vanessa found this card. I agree, we better have a closer look at it. Okay. But first let's do these embers. Or whatever it says. Burning mass before it got destroyed, Katrina. This panel looks like a tree side memory. There's even a lock of hair. I agree, we better set this to you. Okay. Three hours. 
Okay, now let's do this ID card. Okay, fingerprints. We have a nice set of fingerprints off of Dolores' ID card, Katarina. Since she went here, vanished years ago, chances are these aren't hers. Let's get them to the lab. Okay. Okay, we gotta wait for the pendant and fingerprints to finish, so see you all bet. Alright, we are back in criminal case, case 10, smoke and mirrors, so let's get the sauce from that open pendant. What is it? Analyze the DNA of the hair in the pen and you found it wrote I can say for sure that it's Vanessa's. But the hair wasn't cut recently, a simple analysis helped me determine that this hair dates back to Vanessa's childhood. Oh, that's cute. So someone was keeping an old lock of Vanessa's hair in a pendant. You're right, Katrin, it must have been someone close to her. And the only way that we know of is Vanessa's mother, but if the pendant is he hers, how did it end up in that burning mansion? You're right, better go talk to Sharon. Alright. But first, let's get this off from fingerprints. Hey Katarina, as I saw the fingerprints is sent with the quality was top notch and I have big news. Some of these fingerprints belong to Vanessa, which makes sense if she's probably the one who found all her ID. But the other prints belong to Alec Hall. What? How the hell did Alec get his hands on Dolores' ID card? Do you think he met to Dolores while she was still alive? Katarina agreed. Let's go ask Alec about this. But first, let's talk to Sharon. Hey, that's my pendant. I left it to burn it that, burn it that hellhole. Cool. Why did you have it this way, but, but it's an old memory of your daughter. Why would you want to get rid of that pendant, Mrs. Skinner? I forget it. This place is the reason my daughter died. Might as well take my memories now that it has taken my daughter. The pendant was a reminder of sweet times when Anessa showed respect for her mother and when I treated her like a proper daughter. What good are memories now? We wasted so much time hating each other and now she's dead. I'll never get to make to make amends. I'm I'm better off forgetting. But still I'd like to thank you for Katina for arresting her killer. It's a relief to know that sinful place won't ruin mortal eyes. Here, this is all I have to show you my gratitude. Alright, twenty thousand coins as always. Okay, now let's talk to Alec. I found my fingerprints on another prostitute's ID. So what? What is it wasn't my first? And you know, I like to know the identity of my partners. Cut the crap out. Like, all these girls died because of that retail, because of people like like you. Show some respect. Hey, I didn't kill them. It's so Katrina's proof it was my bio. Heck, I myself saw her on one night burying a body in the cemetery. What the? You saw her burying someone and didn't report it, and you didn't say anything while we were investigating? I don't understand. After my bio left, I picked up the ID card that had fallen from the, from the body and I recognized poor Dolores. My bio saw me and you know how intimidating she can be. She said she's since I'd been Dolores' last customer, she'd make it so the, so the police believed I was the murderer. She was ready to ruin my life. Look, I want to make amends. I know where Dolores' body is. There's a bronze rose over her grave in the cemetery. You swine, you're under arrest for obstruction of justice. I agree, sir. Let's grab a quick meal and some showers before heading to the cemetery. Okay. We got the burger. Okay, let's investigate graveyard entrance. I clicked toad let's portray the uh, metal pieces oh got it uh biscuits <coughs> wasp nest uh, rose uh duck okay, there you are this fine man and, uh, and owl <coughs> I 
didn't see the grave Alec told us about. Can you, Katarina? Hmm, you're right. This well PC file looks promising. Let's pass the time. Okay. Okay, let's piece this back together. Rose, Rose Alec told us about, which means the Dolores resting place should be around that area. Now that's my kind of job, Katrina. I'll start digging up. Okay. 30 minutes later. Damn, it feels like I've been digging for ages and I still can't find a casket or a body. What if I like lied to us, Katrina? You still want to have a look at what I've dug up? Sure, be my guest. It's right over there. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's just get top stones. Okay, where's the dragonfly? Ah, oh, there you are. Uh, water strider. Fresh dirt. Okay. Uh, firefly. Angel wings. Uh, where's the snake? Okay, there you are. Glowing hello. Trapdoor. Uh, where's the skull? Okay, there you are. Bucket and bone. <coughs> Sorry. Alright, that's everything I dug up and it's all yours. I hope you can find something useful in all that muck at the <coughs> Apologies. For that. <clears throat> okay, let's do this. Oh my, skulls. Whoa, what the heck are those skulls about, Katarina? Those buttons, yes, yes, it's exactly like the buttons of an SS corpse. Three skulls, three missing girls, and the same models of Randy. You're right, one of these skulls is Dolores, for sure. She's a Danica, they opened my bio behind bars and retrieved the bodies of her victims. This case can finally be closed. Great, let I start by giving the good news to Harvey. Ha, I can't wait to see his face when you tell him it's over. Okay. Okay, let's talk to Harvey. Done it, Secretary. You found these poor girl's bodies. Finally, this nightmare is over. And you think you really think I could I could be one of one bringing the news to girls' families? I I like that. It's time they got, got closer. I'm glad you can put that behind you. Have no more trick of drunk one with bloody eyes in your hand, right? Gosh, no, never again, Katarina. I'm done with this investigation and with all this, you know what? I'll give Sheep or Keys my res resignation. Your resignation? Harvey, you always said you li lived for your job, are you sure? Yes, I'm done. I've seen too much, done too much. I'm too old for this. So, Katarina, I wish you luck. Here's a little gift to remember the good old times. Okay, sunglasses. And shirt. Okay, literate, literate station. Katarina, what you done for Harvey? Well, I just wanted to thank you. I think, I think he's finally ready to move on. I'm so happy that Mr. Fisher is feeling better, Frank. This must be a great relief for you. Katarina, watching you work in the bay was truly ins inspirational. Thanks to everything you have done here, the inhabitants can feel hopeful again. I agree, you are a really positive influence on this team, Katarina. Come with me to my office, please. I need to talk to you. Okay, I'm coming to your office. Katarina, I had to thank you. You've done a lot for the bay, but I think you more than deserve the change of scenery. Which is why I'm sending you to Iron City. It's a colorful and lively place. Always a festival or a celebration going on. I bet you'll be glad to get back to the hostel and bustle of the city. I have to warn you, however, that lately tensions within some of the communities have arisen. This may well prove to be one of your toughest challenges yet, this very clear. Don't worry about me. I'm gonna solve it. But I know you'll make the Pacific Bay PD proud, as always. And I want to, why don't you and team go for a little celebration? You were it. Yeah! Celebrate it. Okay, one sticker pack. New pages in your, al in your album. In my album. Whatever. 
Oh my god, what happened to you? Okay, Einer City. We, <clears throat> we got seven cases. Okay, first... Well, in first New Jersey we got uh, ten, five cases at one in one district, okay. But as always, I'm gonna need some friends, so here we go. Okay, my friends are playing criminal case so much, so I'm not gonna sell all of them. I'll sell the one that, are, that I know they are playing. I didn't say we we're gonna stop you gonna continue playing this episode because I got packs to open and I bought a few more packs on the previous cases. Okay, first pack. Here we go. Oh, it's that girl. And that guy. And this guy. And Harvey, okay. And now let's open another sticker. Two gold seekers and three blue seekers. Okay. Oh, it's that shark as we were arrested, and that girl we arrested. And here's my bio. Okay. And one last pack. It's my bio again. One price seed. What do we got here? Okay, that girl again. I forgot her name. Okay, it's that hunter we arrested. What else? Oh, I think that's the one. That's the one. That's the truck dealer we arrested. Okay, we don't have any sticker packs left. Okay. All right, guys, that's it. We're gonna stop here. We're gonna continue playing in a new district on new case. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like to this video. And I'll see you again. Goodbye.